Bruce Lee's first student. Jesse Glover was a black kid from Seattle. Already a judo champ, he first saw Bruce Lee at a public demonstration, performing kung fu on stage. Bruce had just moved back to the States after a series of street fights and police reports led to his parents sending him home. Hungry for new martial arts styles, Jesse wound up running into Bruce again at Seattle Central Community College, where they were both enrolled. Jesse introduced himself and asked Bruce if they could work out together. Bruce agreed, and the two trained together closely for four years. Many more traditional Chinese disliked Bruce's willingness to reach outside their ethnic community. In their eyes, he was giving away Chinese heritage to outsiders who might exploit it or even use it to beat up Chinese. Lee's response? If I teach them, they're going to have respect for Chinese. Jesse became Bruce's first assistant instructor. As a black man, his experiences of police brutality and race informed Bruce's own perspectives, evident in places like Jim Kelly's Enter the Dragon police brutality scene. Bruce wound up a global superstar. Jesse kept on as a kung fu instructor, creating the non-classical kung fu system that he developed and taught in Seattle and around the world. He passed from cancer in 2012, leaving behind a legacy of students and a place in the history books of modern martial arts.